Okay, so you talked about the idea of um, when you're confronting something that you fear, you like, you face it head on and you, you destroy it. But then you said uh, that the idea is when you're confronting something, you make the world out of it. And I was wondering if you could just, I mean, generally make, expound on make, what that means. You make your marriage out of the arguments. Okay. You know, you have arguments with your wife, you have arguments with your children. That's that chaotic state because no one's been able to formulate a habitable order from that, that domain of controversy and confusion. And then through dialogue, you erect a structure that's a house that you can both live in. And so that's the, that's the idea of making the world out of that chaos. And, and it's, a, it's frightening because, you know, if you really have, and this is why people often avoid having disputes with people they love, because it's frightening, right? You find out what the person's like and you find out what you're like. It's like, God, who wants to do that? Nobody. And so, you know, your heart rate goes up and it's, it, it's confrontation and conflict. And, and, and that's because you're encountering that domain that hasn't been properly mapped or configured. And so, and you're doing that with your predator detection systems, essentially. And so that chaos that, that threatens the stability, say, of the marriage is equivalent to, well, it's equivalent to the serpent in the tree. That's one form of equivalence. And, and then by dialogue, through dialogue and negotiation, you, you formulate the problem. What exactly is going on here? Where exactly are we? What exactly is the problem? And so you keep talking until you reach a consensus about that, one that you can live with, one that you can act out, right? And then, you, then maybe you come up with a solution to the problem and you've established peace again. And peace, that's the house that you can both live in. And that's the chaos. That's the chaos that people can fall into all the time and, and often do. And it's the chaos that makes a marriage wash up on the shores and, and transform into like, you know, 15-year divorce court. Very horrible thing. So that's the idea.